Pompo. That's it. Under orders for the Guineas, and they're away. Mrs. Penny bursts out of the stalls. Pompo S gets a fast one for France, and on the extreme outside is Grandola. And already the field beginning to split into what looks like two groups, although the main lot are coming right over to race on the near side. And it's just uh, two or three right over on the far side who are headed by Grandola from Princess Matilda and Battle Wind. They've already completed nearly two furlongs. And Grandola leads right over on the far side from Princess Matilda and Battlewind. Heading the group on the near side is Etoile de Paris for Ireland. After her comes Ararat behind Ararat, very prominent, Delia, then Evita. Saison has a good position as well. Right over on the near side and somewhere behind the leaders at the boat is Leicester's Mount, uh, Millingdale Lily. And towards the rear of the field, Gift Wrapped and Rapids. But it's two groups, the small group on the far side still headed by Grandola, but the other 20 on the near side, and this group appears to be in front, are headed just about by Etoile de Paris. As they come now towards halfway in the 1,000 guineas, it's over to the grandstand and John Penny. Etoile de Paris won the leaders on the near side with Star Chamber. Mrs. Penny right there with the leaders, also Evita, and also well on turns with them on the far side too is Ararat but leading them on the far side is Princess Matilda and they're coming now past the bushes on towards the final quarter mile and on the near side it's Mrs Penny just about in the lead from our home then comes a Etoile de Paris then making a run on the far side the leading group as quick as lightning on the far side Princess Matilda but on the near side it's our home and Mrs Penny fighting out the finish from quick as lightning on the far side then comes Rapids they're in by the final furlong as they come up towards the line it's our home and quick as lightning quick as lightning now gets up in the last few strikes quick as lightning wins it from our home Mrs Penny then comes Millingdale Lily followed by repeats and then just after those a whole host of horses in fact the last two or three are battle win and finally the last one over is Grandola and so I don't know whether it's happened Let's forget the three on the far side. Just for information, it's Princess Matilda and Battle Wind on the far side, but they're right out of it. On this side, uh, Mrs. Penny has been, as she always has run so well, prominently throughout, and she's just about, I think, in the lead on this side. But making rapid progress, leading the middle of that group is our home, and coming on the wide outside of the lot is quick as lightning. And as they meet the rising ground, it looks like our home is just about getting the better of Mrs. Penny on the rails, and quick as lightning is... Uh, under pressure coming in a bit towards the others you see that's rather interesting under whipping his right hand there and uh, she's coming in a little bit it looks as if uh, our home has got the uh, got the race one but suddenly in the last hundred yards or so quick as lightning straightened out and really goes for it and really wins going away there i think he's changed his whip hand too in the process uh, really changed his whip hand there and goes ahead he wins from our home it looks like mrs penny to me is third millingdale lily is fourth and Rapids, I think that is in fifth place.